Today's Bible verse is from the epistle of Paul the Apostle of Jesus Christ. Romans chapter 5 verse 10. For if when we were enemies, we were reconciled to God, through the death of his Son, much more, having been reconciled, we shall be saved by his life. In this verse, the Apostle Paul is arguing that because Jesus Christ died for our sins, we are now reconciled to God. This means that we are no longer enemies of God, but are instead in a right relationship with Him. Paul goes on to say that if we have been reconciled to God through the death of Jesus, then we will certainly be saved through His life. This means that because Jesus has conquered death, we too will be saved from death and will have eternal life. This Bible verse reminds us of the great love that God has for us. It is also a reminder that because of Jesus Christ, we have the hope of eternal life. Thoughts on today's verse. While we were enemies, this refers to the fact that before Jesus came, we were all separated from God because of our sin. We were his enemies because we had rebelled against him. We were reconciled to God through the death of his son. This refers to the work of Jesus Christ on the cross. Jesus died in our place to pay the penalty for our sins. His death reconciled us to God and restored our relationship with him. Jesus has conquered death. We too will be saved from death and will have eternal life. Jesus' death was not the end. It was the beginning of our salvation. Let's pray. Dear God, I pray for those who are lost and without hope. I pray that you would draw them to yourself and open their hearts to the gospel. I pray that they would come to know the love that you have for them. I pray for those who are suffering. I pray that you would comfort them and give them hope. I pray that you would heal their bodies and minds and bring peace to their hearts. I pray that you would make your face shine upon them and be gracious to them. I pray that you would lift up your countenance upon them and give them peace. I pray for those who are in need. I pray that you would provide for their needs and meet their every need. I pray that you would bless them and give them the desires of their hearts. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen.